Drugs. No, we're, we're okay. Drugs? This is awkward. No, thank you. Drugs. Who, inv who invited? <laughs> You guys, today I'm gonna to be opening up this brand new mat that MetaMats has sent me. I have no idea what Dave has sent me this time around. I really don't. I will note though that the last video I did on this mat, um, I actually got it incorrect because as I noted, the backing material was different and I was feeling the tops of different materials. Turns out this top material is slightly different than the normal MetaMats material. I thought it was just the color of the mat that was tricking my brain and making me think that it was softer, but turns out it is a slightly softer, different material on this mat. Um, and I'm going to be talking about this mat again in this video because I want to be showing off my Meta Mats collection, one of which I'm going to be giving away to the winner of my Discord tournament on my Discord server. Um, shout outs to Ryan for putting that on. Whoever wins that tournament gets a free mat. Um, I've already sent them, you know, the mats that they're going to be, get, be able to choose from. Um, you guys are going to see those mats as well because I'm still sitting on them because the tournament is not over. The winner has not yet been decided, so I haven't shipped out a mat to anybody who won. As always, guys, if you want 10% off of mats, enter in the code YugiJesus on MetaMats.com. You get 10% off. That easy. That easy. Let's open up this mat. Let's see what Dave sent me this time. Uh, this is not coming open. There it goes. Okay. So, let's see what he sent me this time around. Several mats this time around. All right. All right. Once again, we have the new packaging, which I'm just in love with on the mats. These are all zip-ups. Just to give you guys some reference, um, here's one of the older bags that I just had laying around um, in one of the inserts. And this is just, I mean, Dave's always improving, guys. He's always improving, making better and better mats, making better and better everything. That's why we've been together for so long, guys. If he didn't make good stuff, I wouldn't let him sponsor me. And he, if I didn't make good stuff, he wouldn't sponsor me. So that's where we're at. We have this awesome Blue Eyes White Dragon Seto Kaiba. Oh my gosh. So this looks like, so it is going to be a different material. So this is going to be the same material as this mat right here. It looks like. Maybe it's not. Let's look up and see which material he's using on this one. It looks like, here, let me see. Let me bring out this mat. Here's one that I'm going to be giving away. Um, one of the options for the uh, tournament winner, I should say. Let's see if it matches the backing material on this one. Yeah. Okay, so now these two are the same. So it looks like the backing material is the same backing material on this mat. And this one is a um, Black Rose Dragon mat. This one is um, available for one of the winners of the tournament. I already sent them, you know, pictures of that mat. And so the same backing material on this one. That's really cool, though. Um, this is awesome. This He actually has another mat. Um, check this out. So this is just uh, the same backing as that Black Rose Dragon mat. Um, this art. I have, another, uh, I have another one of these mats that Dave also sent me that I also made available to um, the winner of the uh, Discord tournament. This is a one-of-a-kind. Dave sent me. Um, this is more of a rustic look that he put on here. This is not burnt. Um, this is more of a rustic look on purpose and it has a different backing on it. A black backing. Um, this one's a one of a kind that he sent me. Once again, this one's available. I, I'm sitting on it right now, but this one is available to the winner of the Discord tournament. And if you guys are like, oh man, he only gives those out on his Discord server. No, I actually give these mats out on my channel all the time. It's just right now, um, the winner of the Discord tournament gets to pick whatever mat they want. So I'm just going to be hanging on to all of my extra mats and they get to pick the one they want. There's some that I'm going to be showing in this video that are not options to them because they're my mats and I'm never giving them away, but I'm going to be showing off all my meta mats anyways while I'm sitting on them and just know that whenever this tournament is over, I'm going to be one mat shy of what you see in this video because I'm going to be giving one away. So very cool mats. I'm once again, the same exact art as this other one um, that I've already gotten sent. Um, let's, okay, let's go to the next mat though. This I want to, I'm fascinated by this color. I want to see what this is. I think this is the uh, Final Fantasy mat. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is the one he sent me a picture of not too long ago. This color, this color and everything. This mat is gorgeous, guys. Wow. I don't know if I'm going to be giving that one out. <laughs> this mat right here I'll probably make available to the tournament winner as well, but or, uh, or if he doesn't claim it, I'll probably just give this one away in a separate video. This mat is way cool. The color on it is just gorgeous. Like this is way way too good of a mat not to not to give out to somebody because I already have enough cool mats. This one's a really badass mat that I can yeah, I, I could part with this one. This one's really cool. I really like the color though. Dave, you're just you're just a master at your craft at this point, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's just see what this pink mat all about though this is, I have a feeling this mat's gonna be really pretty yeah this one's the koi fish one 
I've seen this one. <laughs> Actually, um, my boy Robert, uh, he makes memes for the Facebook page, just ordered one of these mats and I had, uh, I got a hold of Dave and had him make him, uh, had him make a custom one of these with uh, zones on it too for Robert. So uh, yeah, shout out to Robert, shout out to Dave from MetaMats once again, um, especially for sending me these right now. This mat is gorgeous. Like, okay, this mat right here might not be given away. <laughs> like the more I'm looking at this one, uh, the same so same backing material as the the uh, the other two mats. The same backing material as that Kaiba mat that I showed you. Um, and also, um, it looked, uh, I forgot to check the backing material. Yeah, so the backing material on that green mat also the same backing material as on this mat. I like this backing material a lot. This is a lot grippier and everything than um, the, the first material that he ever was printing um, on the backs of his mats. Um, that, uh, that material was, was good, but like this has been way better. Um, I really like the material on the back of my one of a kind, but you know, once again, it's a one of a kind. Well, technically it's a five of or whatever, and the art on the front's a 25 of, but uh, yeah, it's, it's a five of mats. It's not really, once again, fair to compare the other ones to that one, but uh, this is beautiful. Every single year, it's like he figures out how to get these mats better and better and better and make them more and more and more beautiful. And I mean, he succeeds and he succeeds. This is the most gorgeous mat I've seen since about, uh, I don't know, um, five seconds ago when I saw this one. Like, jeez, these, these are just gorgeous, dude. I love this color. I love this color. Um, yeah, these mats these mats will also be given away probably at some point in time. Um, maybe not this pink one. I might keep this pink one or maybe have them send me, a, send me one in a different color and give away this pink one. I'm not sure, but this mat is amazing, guys. This mat is way kick-ass. If I give this one away, you will know about it. But these are the three mats that he sent me just now. He sent me uh, another one of these Kyber ones that I already had that I will show you again if you want to see that uh, one of a kind with the black backing. Um, you just stay tuned for one second and I'll go through my MetaMats collection with you. Uh, at least how it stands currently while I'm sitting on a bunch of mats. So um, we have this green one once again. Um, I, I think that's Final Fantasy, I'm not sure. Uh, the Koi Fish one is just gorgeous. And then Seto Kaiba in the classic Blue Eyes White Dragon, which you can never beat. I can't think of a more iconic card than Blue Eyes White Dragon, except maybe Dark Magician or Exodia the Forbidden One, you know what I mean? Like Blue Eyes White Dragon, Seto Kaiba. There's not very many things that are more classic Yu-Gi-Oh, you know what I'm saying? And uh, speaking of which, here's the rustic one again. Uh, black backing, one of a kind. This one's the Black Rose Dragon mat, also available on metamats.com. These mats are all available on metamats.com, guys, all of them. Um, you don't have to wait till I show them on my channel, you know, they're all, they're already there. Um, he just sends them to me so I can show you guys, you know, so you know that they're there. But um, yeah, Black Rose Dragon. Very cool. I mean, the, the artists that he gets are just top notch always. And then um, here's the mats that you guys saw in the last video I made about meta mats. Um, and this one's just a classic one with zones, kind of a retro mat feel. Um, it's just it's just a classic kind of a, I don't know, I guess like a spell ground, more of a spell grounds style maybe, I guess you could say. But it's just that rustic, classic, you know, retro, vintage, whatever you want to call it. That's the, the kind of look that he's going for th with this mat. And uh, the zones are great, you know. Um, he's not like slapping the logo everywhere just on the extra deck zones. I think it looks great. And then um, here's one that's really interesting. I had to make me this one years ago. I designed this one a long time ago and just sent it to him and was like, hey, print this on a mat for me. And uh, yeah, this one's the one I made. This was the first mat I designed for him uh, to make me just personally because don't forget MetaMats does uh, custom mats all the time. You can uh, buy a design from them or you can uh, send them as a design and they'll print it on a mat for you. Um, and this is one I had printed on a mat because I was trying to come up with like a classic Yu-Gi-Oh mat that, you know, just for me personally and one I could show on the channel. And I always love the Seal Bori Calcos Waking the Dragons is my favorite uh, Yu-Gi-Oh art. Uh, and then I was just like, I was playing with the color of, of, of Slifer and I, was, and I was trying to figure out a way to fit all the God cards on here. And I was like, wait a minute, I can just have Slifer, Slifer and then color correct it this way. And it's Slifer and then blue and yellow, like raw and obelisk. And I was like, that's good enough. And this looks like kind of trippy the way I have the um, hieroglyphs like meeting in the middle and stuff. And it looked cool. Um, he made it, uh, he even liked the mat and was like, man, this mat's tripping me out. Like right after he made it, he was like, this mat's tripping me out. <laughs> and um, I don't know, I've had this mat for a while. This is kind of like the mat I use when I play um, 
in my garage or something <laughs> like or like I don't know um, I, I use this as like um, kind of more of a, a fun play mat uh, this is the mat I take to tournaments with me right here and like uh, in bigger events and all that uh, this is kind of my show off mat once again this is the one of five I made a video called what I bring to the table where I'd show off my deck box and you know and uh, all my gear that I bring to tournaments uh, this is the mat that I bring to tournaments guys this is a waterproof mat um, special backing one of five mat I mean I've talked about this at great length um, it's it's my favorite mat that, that Dave has made me it's a kick-ass mat there's there's not very many of them there's not really much more to say um, I will say this though this one is another one being given away right now on the discord server this one's a one player mat and this one I think is a one of at the moment only one of this exists this one's a prototype I think but this right here has me in cyber dragon in all of its glory and then you know Eugene and uh, larvae moth just uh, being Eugene and Larvae Moth, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, this one is also available. And um, so check this out. Now I'm gonna go over the rest of the mats that are being uh, given away, or the, you know, that are options for the winner of the Discord tournament right now. But um, then I'm gonna show you uh, the first mat that Dave ever made me, and it's the first mat, uh, first meta mat I ever made a video on. But this right here is the Mermail mat. So once again, uh, same backing as all the rest of these mats, exact same backing, same material. Um, some sometimes it's hard to uh, you know check on the backing unless you look really close, and then other times it's really obvious, like the difference between those two. But yeah, this one's the uh, Mermail mat. Um, I actually had Dave uh, make one for my friend Baron one time and just send me one. Like this, this mat's kick ass. Like uh, the Mermail players love this mat. I've not met a Mermail player that did not like this mat. Um, this. This is a Naruto mat that um, is actually printed sideways. So, so sometimes uh, Dave will give me like his misprinted mats, like because sometimes he me he messes up. Um, but he gives me th in these to give away to you guys um, instead of throwing them out or trying to sell them as like I don't know a non mess up mat. Um, he gives he gives them you know, to me so I can just give them away. And um, yeah, this one's like I think if I remember printed sideways, so like it's not quite right. But it's still a cool mat. Um, you know, still has uh, you know plenty of people like Naruto. It's still a, definitely a mat. It's just a uh, he kind of printed it wrong or something. <laughs> I'm actually not 100% sure what's wrong with it, except I think it's, once again, I think it's just like the art was supposed to be printed this way and it was printed this way. And that and that's the only thing wrong with it. And then the last mat that the uh, tournament uh, participants know about is uh, this right here. This is just your standard um, Way of the Warrior. But there's two of them, Way of the Warrior and Spirit of the Warrior. One of them's got the, you know, this cherry blossom on it and the other one's got a warrior on it. But um, Dave's had this mat um, in his line for a long time. This is uh, one of the first like really pretty um, designs that he got uh, for his mats, like you know, full color, pink, red, you know, blue, like all these different colors. It's one of the really early ones, um, and he's still making it. And this mat still looks great. I still like this mat a lot. It's a classic mat. But that's the last mat that the tournament winner um, is aware of. You know, like the last one I posted on my uh, Discord server to show them is their options. And then right here, guys, I mean, it's dirty. <laughs> like, uh, that's what I'm saying. Uh, all these are machine washable, though. I should wash this. I, I just never wash them, but they are machine washable. Um, at least uh, most of them are. I don't know about my my one of a kind or whatever. It might not be, but like the rest of them are. Like, all, all of them are machine washable. Um, but this right here, guys, the Stay Salty and uh, Get Ratchet for Jesus mat. This right here is the first mat that uh, MetaMats ever made for me, ever. This is the first mat that Dave ever made for me, and it's still mega soft. Uh, it still looks great. <laughs> like, um, I still play on it a lot. I play on it with friends when I'm messing around. This is, you know, another mess around mat uh, similar to, I guess you could say, uh, the one I had to make. Uh, I, I guess I didn't really name this one. Um, we'll, I mean, we'll call it like Waking the Slifer or something. I don't know. Waking the Gods, I guess you could say, or Waking the Ori Calcos. I don't know whatever you want to call that one. But uh, I, I treat it uh, more similar to this mat. Um uh, we'll treat them uh, the same. They're just more play mats. You know, I've had them for a really long time. And then, uh, of course, like, you know, my other mats that he sent me, I kind of uh, baby a little more. You know, they're, they're uh, more, uh, more hard to find. But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, that is all of my Metamats collection as, as it stands right now. Um, you know, until I give out more, of course. Um, you know, I'm always giving out mats on this channel or on the Discord server. I mean, the guy gives me tons to give away, so I might as well give them out, right? And I guess the last mat... I can show you what's a cool mat I can show you beside this is a cool mat I could show you. This is the only non-meta mat I'm gonna show you in this video besides, you know, the, the Yugi Jesus mat that uh, Theo made me a long time ago that I use, you know, as the backdrop, you know, for all these kinds of videos. But uh right here, Cyber Dragon Revolution Structure Deck mat. I have the Cyber Dragon mat. Oh yes. Um, a fan actually sent this to me uh, through fan mail. 
I've had it ever since, and yeah, whenever uh, whenever the next real life uh, Cyber Dragon deck profile is done, it will be done on this map. So be looking out for that. Also be looking out for, you know, map giveaways and tournaments and, you know, all the other cool shit I'm always doing. And that's the end of the video. Subscribe! <laughs>